West Yorkshire Police, the fourth largest police force in the UK, about 5,000 officers. We police a population of about 2.2 million people. Some very large cities with some deprived areas, real policing challenges, and uh, we do a lot of difficult work. Tour of Yorkshire is a world-class sporting event. It's the largest annual sporting event that takes place in the UK in any of our regions. Up to two million people come to watch it across the three days at the various towns, villages and the route. And for us it's about really making it safe for the public, that's our prime job. Um, but actually, equally, it's about making sure everyone has a really good day. You're running a, a major international sporting event, you want to improve it every year. And technology has got to be a vital part of doing that. Behind the, the glitz and the glamour of the colour and the cyclists and the crowds, there has to be a very smart, very well organised and very well delivered plan to make it happen. And that's why we have really been investing in better technology to support the work we do. Within the event planning we uh, liaise with the local authorities and obviously for the Tour de Yorkshire we have uh, four police forces. Each of those have their own local authorities. There's also the other emergency services, the uh, fire and ambulance, the military uh, and then obviously the general public in way of traders, uh, businesses, local businesses that may be affected. Uh, it's quite a complex procedure. We've been working with Dimension Data to look at a system that can track and monitor certain police resources that are uh, involved in the race. Also associated with the, uh, the planning process, there are several companies, uh, the major breweries in Tadcaster, have uh, regular deliveries which are time conscious and, and as such they can use the software system to plan their deliveries around the race and the race timings. Tracking uh, devices across different vehicles uh, is allowing us to have real connectivity with what we do in the race and, and the other systems that we bring into play in, in managing it and it's allowing us to be much smarter in the way we plan to deliver cycle racing. As well as being monitored by the police and myself, it gives me a, a bird's eye view of what's happening within the race, uh, but it also enables the public on a front-facing website to look at uh, what's happening, when they can expect closures to be lifted in their area, or when they can expect the race to come through. We've tried to make this as simple as possible. All the data's in the cloud. If you have your phone, if you have the app on it, you can connect straight to it and find out what's going on. And the system's up and running and any issues are reported straight away back to ourselves. And this is the, the first time that we've planned on using this with the other events. It's so easy to use that uh, we will offer the facility to the Metropolitan Police uh, and Surrey for Ride London and the forces that we'll visit during the Women's Tour and the uh, Men's Tour of Britain. Policing is all about teamwork and in the Tour of Yorkshire we have police officers from all over the UK joining us and working together to make the public safe. I mentioned data have a tagline of uh, greatness within the sporting arena and uh, to apply that to a policing principle we, we aim to provide a first class service to the public and, and to be uh, safe in anything that we do.